Hey everybody, it's Son of Peace and I am Terry Crews. This is where it comes down to this, the final two teams in a Stanley Cup final. This is where the matchup ends here for NHL Season 3 of EA Sports. It's the Hurricanes battle against the Canucks. It's all coming up next after this. Hey everybody, it's Lightbulb here, and I am here with another commentary of the crew. This is Boomer. And that's right, we are ready to have the next matchup, and this is Game 2 of the Stanley Cup Final on EA Sports. This time, Carolina Hurricanes have started things up here with a 1-0 score over the Vancouver Canucks. But this time, we're going to see if there is a choice in between. That's right now at this moment. Canucks have never been able to face things over, and they really wanted to try to finish it off as soon as they can. Will this be another take in for a win for the Canucks to tie the series up, or will this be Carolina Hurricanes to have another win? As for your next commentator, I will have the next one coming on. As right now, it's Terry Cruz. He's also along with Test Tube, and in the third commentary of the group, he did a great point to take over. As it's fall point pen. And in center ice, I have it across here in between to get that one a good look and to help him out is my friend. We'll see you all later here for the post game show right after this game. And don't forget, we've got the NBA Finals that's happening here for game three. Keep your eyes peeled here for the next part of the game here in between three and four at Miami for the Mavericks against the Heat. And the new season will be happening here for the WNBA that will be here on August 23rd. That's where it's going to happen right now here for the first part of the game to keep an eye on the prize. In the meantime, that's it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in for the free game show. Let's get on down to the to the Rockies Arena for game two. Guys, all yours. Hey everyone, it's Terry Cruz. We are at Vancouver for the second game of the conference to the Stanley Cup Final. It's a matchup and we are ready to go. I'm here with my broadcasting partner with Terry Cruz and Testu and Ballpoint Pang. This is Stanley Cup Final on EA Sports. We are off to start and we are ready to go. For the group of the Canucks, here's Patterson. Serving's over. This one's gloved up by Kutchikov. Kutchikov's a starting goaltender for the Carolina Hurricanes and Tasha Demko is a starting goaltender for the Canucks. Patterson is one of the better range to have a sniper in his own ability to keep that for a long range distance. Tentacom is one of the better range to pick up a skilled up challenge. His one way to have a better with crossing angle is the move that can go right from the side or from up and over the net. I'll find out with those two between a Patterson and of course, Frank Tentacom. We'll find out if there's more. Back to you. Patterson with the buck now in order to wait. Shoots it, well saved by Kuchikov. 19 or 7 to go in the first period. Getting ready for the next face off as they are in the center ice now. Ready, ready for another puck drop. Ago wins the face off. Burns is right toward the corner, passing over to Slavin. And Ago wants to control after another puck. Suter will fire that out. Now here's Slavin. Slavin trying to hold on to it. Trying to grab the puck out free. And Ago with the puck. On his way to Terravine in. Toward the right wing, looking for room. Takes a pass, such a good shot. Big save by Demko. You know, Demko doesn't really make the save in that one a little bit worse. I always say that for now, but Demko is just trying to keep at all of it at the right time angle. Sometimes it doesn't really get over into it well, and there might be another chance of her to have that one stopping down. I mean, it's not always easy enough to do this for, but they've got to play a great like It's a real game. If you don't play it right, you got to try to like communicate with each other. Good chance for a shot, for the rebound, oh, Demko, what a save! That wild one was almost picking out out there, and that Demko made that one with a huge save. That is legit. And here's Cole with the puck. On his way to Miller. Miller, stop with the shot, he scores! That's her first goal in the finals against the Canadian in the 
of the American of the Page. This one puts a hit, but Miller was going to get a chance. Watch the fence for that. He has that one move, trying to charge to the puck, and this one got it. The match got it started. The one nothing lead in Vancouver League. As Cole will have it over to Freeman. Passes broken up, and Natchez will have it the air away. Losing the air away back in possession now in the corner. Freeman will try to carry that one out of here. Here is Cole. Go to left wing, finding Mikheyev. Nice save by Kochikov. Mikheyev now finds Freeman. Freeman to Besser. With a shot, a big chance separate, and save puts up at a goaltender. You know what happens when Kochikov? That has to be what they're doing it for. They got to do it when they have got to play it right for it in between each other. It's not always easy when you're doing it at the right time, but hey, let's make it simple enough. They need to do some a little bit more passing aggressiveness, but they are playing offensively, not a chance at all. Here's Lingmo with the puck in the airway. Lino finding for those hands. Shot stopped by Kuchikov. 16-11 to go in the first, and they were ready to take the next face off. On a chance effort, ready to have a next face off in Carolina, trailing by one. Vancouver, lead by one. Here's Jarvis with the puck. Takes a stop. Zadora, no chance here as he grabs for the loose puck. And now it's over to Pesky. Pesky beat pass to Martinuk. Martinuk lost that one. No quarter given here as he battles for the loose puck. Recovering the effort by Pocose. Now the Canucks are back in the offensive zone on the attack. Looks at Garland and now finds Pocose. Oh, a big hit puts up for the Canes to stop him by. That's going to hurt. I don't know what's going to keep on him going, but that must have been like a outsway. I don't know what's going to happen now. They're going to really need to keep that one out. Hubblinger with the puck here now racing his way towards to get the suitor. Martin Hook back to Burns. The Hurricanes are back in the Canucks zone. Fires a shot. Great blocker stop made by Demko. And Ago will now take it over. With a chance to tear a line in. To Ago's shot. What a pat save. Ago back to Burns. Burns trying to give up to tear a line in. Rebounded by Spetsikov. Takes it in a shot. What a save. Aglander gives it back to Zadora. Zadora. What chance in front. Patterson shoots. That went out control with the puck and went down. Here's Slavin. Slavin will have it over in towards the other way. Chance on a play after a shot. That saved by Demko. You know what? Demko really had to be done. And this one wasn't really what he was going to do. Because that really has to keep that one out of the line. They don't really have to like keep on tormenting it like they did. But they need to do some a little bit of impressional on their work and the ethic. They need to do some a little bit of a change off to have that one stick out. It's not what you play for. You have to play it if you get it for real. And that's what they don't really care for. You've got to try to pick something else out to get right to it. Carolina back the airway and Slater will have it. Toward the right wing. Spins around. Looks it over to Burns. Burns shot. Saved up by Zemko. Here's Quinn Hughes, he's right toward the left wing. Oh, hello, that's a big hit. What a monster takedown by Slavin. That Slavin was putting that Demko takedown, that's no use for that. I don't know what's going to keep on going, but that is a big shutdown. Officials are ready to drop the puck in, and we are underway. What goes to score Vancouver? The win for Vincent. Demko stops the puck, and with only 12.34 to go in the first. Here's a call. We have to Demko. Demko is one of the really rich saves of the night. 
the ultimate ability must keep on it where it goes. Because of his point with this Ely Rooster shape, that's why his leg work has been cleaning up and a better way to have it defended. Buck sends out a play and we're ready for the face-off. After a ring-off goal post, they're ready to do a next draw. And Drewy will win the face-off. Miller with the puck. Miller still has it. Now the Canucks are in the offensive zone. Orlock with the puck seal. And Bunny will have it again to Chatfield. In towards the middle. And a shot! Patrick plus saved by Dimko. Under 12 minutes remaining in the first, they'll have the next face off on its way. Everybody's really loving the call in between the, the last winner remaining, Florida Panthers. They have won their Stanley Cup, and this is what they have always been bringing on. A lot of Canadian teams are in disappointment right at this moment because they have never won each Stanley Cup since the regular many years ago in the postseason. But all that happened to be mission accomplished for Florida Panthers. Yeah, I know what happened now. I think the number one team, see, I think they really wanted to beat the Canadian team for real. But why would they have to go with the probable in between the Canadian to win a whole thing than the American team? That might be a question of what is up with the team. What's the relation of it? What's going to happen if there's another team in, in, in pursuit? There might be another way they can try to stop us all, but there's no answer to that. That could be a hard way to do this one, but not for long. It might happen for any game in the releasement to have it stuck in mind. There's no other questions of what's going to be living it in here because that American team, they're playing it really well. And that's not going to happen. What they're going to do for, they're going to keep on coming down, winding back, and they got to do something else to make it quick. I should have known a lot of it, but this is what Vancouver is trying to like, let them do. Be positive, and that angle doesn't really mean to most of it on the pros and cons between how hard they play. What's the difference about? Not the choice for baby. Here's Barton up with the bucket now in toward the right wing. Right behind the net, and Cole will have it again to Buck Rosen. Keep the pass, Chatfield with the buck steal. Here's Stahl right toward the middle. Moving around again, pass to Martin up, looks back to Orla, fires it! Great defensive effort here by Hoglander. In the attacking zone, Limbo, then on to Hoglander, poking up. And Ago will now have it the other way. Suter's got it again, and Terramine with the buck steal. On a break attack, he doesn't able to get through the tying goal game. Chance in front to Pedersen. Blocked by Chatfield. And here's Svetrikov. Two on one opportunity. Saved by Demko. On the pad, it's just not always to pick up the rebound, but that is what they're just trying to let them do. And when Demko gets a good save, gotta have it all. Playing it for real there, guys. Oh, Pedersen went down already, and Chatfield will have it back. You don't have an answer to that. You don't really take what Pedersen does. This is really going to be a hard takeover. You're not going to play it like that, or you don't want to make a mess of it. If someone's attacking on you, you're going to get defended. Edison with the rebound for the shot. Mikhail with the goal and the number four goals in the game. They don't really see what's going on like that. That just made it in their clean. The Hurricanes driven by two. Vancouver made a better team out there with the disappointment in game one, but hopefully game two won't be long going. Drury wins the face off. Now the airway will come in by. Pass over to Natchez. And it's Drury with the puck. And he scores. That will be the first goal in the finals against the Canucks. This is just what happens after that to Jack Drury, and this one was keeping it in there. That goal just made that one blind it up, but that really had to be Burns' idea to give over to Natchez. And then when Drury had it, he just got a puck and he got it all. 
the Kings are on the board. It's a 2-1 game right from the start of the first period in game two. Miller wins the base off as Hughes will have an air away. Oh, that's a big hit out there. I've never seen anyone that does that. But right toward her right wing, he has it again, the jury. Jury for two, running shot. That's saved off by Demko. The last part of the game that happened to be game one was Michael Bunning. He had four goals at all. Just a better range out there. I say Michael Bunning was really like how epic he is. Just playing it for real. Whenever you just don't try to like commend it to him, I mean, you gotta get it on when you got. Bunning right behind the net. Pass to Burns. Burns with the slab. Sleep it. Loses the puck effort. And hey, here's McKayan. Trying to look for some offensive run. Besser, lost the puck. Poked it out, great chance stopped by Slavin. Slavin on a two-on-one pass break shot. Big stop by Dimko. And here's Kukemi. Find those in. Bad save, this one stayed out. Right behind him, that is fast. Takes a smash in again. Now here's another win for Nozin. Trying to let it go. They get it on by Cole. Here they come, right toward the center of the ice. And Slavin grabbed that box here. Now finding Buck Enemy. And Slavin lost that puck effort. Can't find an open man. Fires it! That's stopped by Kutchikov. 6.13 left to go in the first period. Get ready to make the next face off hit. Now they're ready to do one again. Canucks are up by one. It's a 2-1 game. After a face-off drop pop, the Vancouver Canucks win it. And here's Sarah Biden. Toward her right wing, going in the middle is Peshke. No chance here. That stays out of here. Sirius grab it, and now he's in the Canucks to the Kane zone. A big hit. Now, now Shea with the puck over now to the Terra Rebounded the puck. Here's a shot for Spokakov. And it's denied by the goaltender. Oglinder right into the left way. Nice left save by Kochikov. Mm hmm Now I have to be really like, how defended are you? You've got to play hard. Now the teams are set for the next face-off. Two ones to score, Vancouver. Face-off win for the Canucks. Oh, a nice pass saved by Kochikov. And we're off to do the next face-off. Vancouver up ahead by one. Now the win puts in for Vancouver. Chop the stick up and then we'll have to replace a new one. You know how bad that happened? Doesn't really mention what he was going to do because that part of the stick, he's going to have to get a new one. Here's McCulton to Garland. This one's blocking. This one's tipped out. Off the stick and went home. Not a bad stop. We're under five minutes remaining in the first. Here's Avo. He will now have it over again to Terabine. We cover the puck and Terabine will have it in the corner. Lynn Holmes got that puck in, now back to Vancouver to the King zone. With a shot! Oh, hit off the goal post! That stayed out of his own! Ooh, that was a little too close to call out there. I wasn't expecting what was going to happen like that. Never stop. That's saved by Demko. Demko freezes it up and we're coming down to it nearing the end of the first period here. Now their teams are ready to line up. They have the puck face off coming up. Now the win for the Hurricanes is Slavin to Drury and a stop made by Demko. Off the other way to Mikheyev. Towards his zone, pass over to Besser. That stop made by Kochikov. 3.47 left to go in the first period. He will try to make a move on the next one. Here's a chance. You have Jacob Slavin. 
slave it is what a big shutdown ability that has all in the take in between. The better defenseman he has definitely put a wrap and it puts a step initiative of slamming it down right toward the offensive zone. It's great rushing for the defense, but there's more that could get on its way. Here's Price Besser. And off to McKayan. McKayan have to give a good look, and it's Kuchikov with the save. That one makes a stop with only 3.18 to go. Now they're ready to do one again. Vancouver Canucks are trying to get that answer back. Face off, win for Stahl. Given a no quarter here as he battles for the loose puck. And here's Bruins. He will have it over now, finding the pass again to Slavin. Slavin right toward the right wing. Oh, I think that must have been a payback on Arone. Stahl's got that puck, finding Burns. And now it's off to Martinuk. Martinuk right entering his own. Pass over Stahl for a chance to tie it. Never get. Spins the move. Backhander. And went behind it. But there was a tip back in. That goes to Stahl to tie this game. Unbelievable moment. As it now ties this game 2 2. Let's watch what happens. That Demko didn't really expect what he was going to do. Because when you look at the gold net, this is what happens with the puck. He couldn't see where he was going, but that one would just slip it already. Oh boy. That was a little bit of range out of sight. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. It must have been that that puck was like a free and is escaping from the back of the pad. That must have been caught up with underneath the pad out there, and this didn't really get right through it at all. And if it didn't really go in there, that's been a bigger problem. That almost would have been caught in it too short, but that was just how it is. Denko would have made the save. But it went in the net, it's too late to do that now. Here's Skate. Right over now to Pesky. And here's Stahl. And it's full with the puck seal. Under two minutes remaining in the first as Besser has the puck. 3 on one opportunity. Puck broken up. Back to Freeman. Freeman giving a good look. And a chance was saved by Kuchikov. During the 90 second mark in the first period as they'll get ready for the next faceoff. Now they're off to do it again. Now the win for Miller and fires that shot. This one stays out with a great bold defensive effort. Skaggy with the buck now firing again to Svechikov. And he will have to battle that one out of here. Now Skaggy will have it again to Ajo. Vancouver's got that puck control in a center ice. Here's Mikheyev with under a minute. Stopped by Kuchikov. This is really what they're expecting now for Kuchikov to have that real inbound. When you don't play it like that, you've got to try to figure something else out. Miller now finds again to Mikheyev. And Mikheyev right toward the corner. Pass off to Besser. On a shot. Blocked it up. Miller. Oh, Kuchikov made this one a stop. A chance effort for a lead. Didn't go in. Coming down to a 30 second mark. All tied up for two. Now the win for the Hurricane to Slave and we'll have it again to Natchez. A chance up and right toward for the win. Pass to Punning. That one is off the target and it's back to Hughes. Here's Hughes. Spins across, back to Pagose. And off to Little Shot. Taking it back, shot, stopped by Kochikov. What a chance effort here for Vancouver. That one was taken a little bit to expect it, but that must have been the end of a first period. Yes, that was the end of the first period. That was going to make a great save. That happened to be all. What they done, it wasn't easy enough for him to go for it. So that ends the first period. Both teams tied up for two. We'll get to the second to get a leadoff after this. Welcome back to Rogers Arena. Ready to start the second period of Game 2. On a start run, and we are all ready to go. Alright guys, 
to have a little bit of a take of how they did in the first period. Let's see what your thoughts are. Well, that may have been happening. The Carolina Hurricanes have definitely made a comeback switch this year to tie this game up. It was a little too early to start that one in the range, but I know this wasn't really that hard enough to try to like, control it. All the effort he had done, they were putting up a big push-off. They're doing it as much as they can, but they didn't really have it a lot of time to have it in there. I have to say right now, Demko and the team just really need to try to configure it. Everybody. They have to make sure they have that one in the right time and ability to get right through it. You know, that happened to be with Demko with the Wild Saint. This was really that excellent at all. Because the puck was flying off the glass and this one just went right towards him near the goalpost. I must have said I must have tipped it in there, but I think that must have won why how that happened. Now the way for Patterson as he finds it to Moronic and here's Hughes. Finds a pass to Goldwinder. Goldwinder right toward the right wing. That shot's up again on the face mask. And now here's Petrikov. Kicks the puck out of the zone. Back to Goldwinder. Another big hit out there in traffic. Terrifying him with the bucket. To get the pass over to Yonko. And that one misses. Terrifying it. Chance for a shot, scores! Wow, that was excellent! Timo Terravainen brought their team up in the head. That's what happens now, because when you know what Timo Terravainen had done, it had to be a little bit quite closer of anything. You know, I was really stumped out because the Timo Terravainen was really making this way. On a better chance ever, because that was really working it in there, and that one was just went tipping in there. Nothing just stands out here for Tito Terramino, but that's what he has been calling it for. Now it's a 3-2 game as Carolina are up by one. And the win will put it up for Carolina. Nages right toward the corner. That misses wide. And here's a Ronick. He will now have the pass over to Bessner. Two on one opportunity. And a save puts up by Kochikov. Miller take back over to Hughes. And Bessner shot. Up again on the glass. Brett Burns got that puck. Now finding the pass over the open look. Here's a quick one to Drury, and it's off the blocker by Demko. Natchez with the puck now again to skate. Now finding Drury. Looks again to Pesky. Shot. Another pick stop here by the goaltender. This one was not always what they were expecting for him. Tactic Demko's really trying to look at his way through. But he doesn't want to make that one uncomfortable if he does that more. Vancouver in the corner. Michael Bunning has it across back to Stahl. He gaining his own in center. That's another stop by the goaltender. How did he hold it on that boy? They don't mind fine Besser. Besser right toward the corner. Kicks that out and now it's fast. Pass making his way in right towards the pass to Martinuk. Skate, finding Pesky. Off the deflection and it goes right toward the wall. And now rebound by Skate. Garland shot. Never stop here by the goaltender. On the rig rebound. Freeman, right toward behind the net. And here is Lindholm. Shoots it and it's off and choppy shot. Baski gets back to Fax. On the inbound. Get the pass to Stahl. Stahl shot saved by Demko. Never going to happen now, but Demko is really getting a little bit of a use out of the skill. He's going to get that one a lot harder and get it challenging right. Here's Orlov finding Svechikov. And now Svechikov will have it to Orlov. Here's Sebastian Ago right toward in the wing. Passes the fast, and it's stopped by Demko. Coming down to a passing 15 minute mark in a second. Now a 3 2 game, Carolina. Ago wins the faceoff. Chaffield in the bound, and that one stops it. Nice catch by Demko. He got a good piece of it, and he will keep that over, covered for the next faceoff. Now they're off to do it again. Vancouver trailing by one, three two. Patterson wins the faceoff, and now Juleson will have a chance to get to Suter. 
Sooner right toward the wing. Shot, stop again. For the big rebound, and another take for the goaltender. Orlov keeps it in to battle for the loose puck of a chain. On the shot. Oh my goodness, that's another stop by the goaltender. This doesn't happen most of it all because what Kochikov has done, that had to be one way to get through. Vajikov off the glove again by Demko. This is really like a hard, intense matchup. I never see what's going to happen like that. Sharabinen shot, and a stop by Demko. Demko will get a rest here with under 15 minutes in the second. They're in the back half of the period. Carolina up ahead, 3-2. And a face-off win for Zadora. We'll get that puck out of the zone. Besser, the pass over, shot, and rebound puts up, and take over! What a chance for Kochikov! Burns to Slavin. Tries to get back to Bunny. Bunny can cut in traffic, and pass stopped by Tim Go. He will hold it here with only 14.01 to go in the second. Fans, if you're ready to take the next one in, we got NHL for a new season to cast your votes. That's happening here on July 17th and July 18th is the NBA 2K Sports for a new season. So that will be NHL 25 for season four to cast your votes of which team you want to go for next. Every team is definitely in between the Eastern or Western Conference. All each teams that played previous will not count. Make the choice right, and if you like it, just enjoy it. If not, you might want to check out the highlights in between of the regular seasons and the postseason last season. Probably there might be a one way to have it all. And your choice, it can be in between the USA team or the Canadian team. Chances are, your time's five. That's happening here on July 17th, don't miss that out. After a stop by Demko, Stahl will have it out. And it rolls into the center ice. Now Burns will have it again to Fast. Fast chance here right in toward the corner. And Zadorov will have it now on the other side of it to give off to Volkanov. Here's Suter. Shot! Stop again by the goaltender. The rebound picks up for Miller. Suter right toward the cutback. Arona give off to Hughes. Shot stopped by Kochikov. 12-12 remaining in the second period. Going to take another face-off in between. And don't forget the NBA playoffs. And definitely the finals will be on its way here. So there will be some, a lot of them to be determined. But that won't be underway here. But doing a bracket is not always easy enough. So we'll have to take a little bit of an in-between rest. So use time wisely. And of course, we definitely wanted to say is that the NBA postseason coming down to an end. We got some couple games left in between. We got the Heat facing against the Mavericks at the Gasea Center. That's happening here in Game Four, and then we'll, we'll head back to Dallas again for Game Five in the Brunchman. That'll be all games here. Once again, cast your votes here for the NBA 2K Sports for Season 9. That's a new season for 2K25 on July 18th. If not, watch them here. And these are all the games I would recommend watching in between the basketball players, the teams, and everything. That's all here, only on Center Beats. And all the stories will be set out here in between on the social medias, so use your time wisely. Here's Suter, and we're coming down to the back half of the period. He goes down. Here's Pesky. Now has a chance here to take over ahead. Loses it quickly over to Svechikov. Svechikov. Got him out. Oh, picks up a wild save. That's two in a row. Oh, man, that was nowhere to be stopped. Three-time stop for Demko. Look at this place. They are just gasping out already. Can you feel it? Yes, I can feel it now. I mean, this is what they are doing for. They really are expecting that like, there is a lot of it safe for Tatcha Demko. They're really all over it now. Gotta play it for real. The is the game ready to drop the puck, and we have passed the midway mark of the period in the second. 
Leno wins the face off. Friedman, very high. This one will stop the pad again. This isn't really happening out there for I mean, hmm, what's the pick? Right. Here's Garland shot. Up again at a goaltender. Pokes it out. And here comes Bunny. Toward the wing. Rebounded it. Fine C. Skinny. Right over to Pesky. And now he's safe. That one rolls it back into Garland. Here's a take. Shot. Off the block there. That one takes it over. Garland battling for the loose puck. Now has it over to Cole. Cole chance to play in front with the tie. Oh, no, no, he stopped. That one stays out of the zone. Here's Drury. The pass to Nietzsche. On a chance up front. Nice take in. And a stop by Demko for the goaltender. This is really going to be like an intense of this game. Tatcher Demko is not leaving at all. But how can he play it like that? But sent down right to Carolina zone. And now Burns will have a chance to beat past the Martin. Up. Bumps up the corner of the wall. And now it's a door off right toward the corner of the net. Lonnie Besser. Spinning, spreading his way down. Will fire that out. Trying to clear the zone. It will battle for the loose puck. And Burns will now find Sleeman. Slavin chance. This one goes back to Burns. Here's fast right toward the center. Vancouver back the air away it goes. Stole with the puck steal. Another stop by the goaltender. Fires it. Up the glove. And as this one's off the stick, he scores. Jordan Martinuk with another take of the goal in the finals. Now it's stand up by two. You know, I have to tell you now, after the broken stick, this is what happened now. Jordan Martinick was seeing the vision out there. He made that one a little bit of, uh, bit clearable, but that made that one with the great one to try to blind that goaltending away. He really had to turn it over. He didn't really see that one where it was going to go in. So he knew it. He found a way to get through an open look. He had a little bit of squeeze open to get there. That's what's able to get the puck in there at the right timing. Here's Oppo finding Spencer Cobb. Another stop here by Demko. You know, it definitely has a problem right now with Demko. They need to be doing a little bit of a hard extra careful here. Because if they don't play well, they gotta try to like let them go. Now the next face-off is on. Carolina has been a, one of the better teams here, just like the Florida Panthers. They extend up by two. And she'll say fouling along the puck. And the range finding the door off. Here we come, right toward the wing. Here's his Hotlander. Over the rim, and that was stopped by the Kochikov. Ago trying to spin it across, finding Slavin. Now finding Terabine. The Kings are back in the offense. Now we're stopped here by the Demko. Now he will try to find the pass over. An open look. And here's another take. Oh, you just hit! I think there's a charging on that one. Yeah, I think the bad one has happened now. Slavin just got a little bit nasty getting. I think he whacked him, and this is not turning what there is. That is a payback lesson. So the power play comes on for the Vancouver. You know how bad that is when you don't do a bit of charging at that point? If you're spinning down and you're trying to hit someone, you try to knock somebody out of here. And you can't do that. You can't play it like when you do here for the offense, and this is not telling you what they're expecting to do. You don't play it like that. You watch out for the charging. You can't play it like they did. Every time you are trying to race in 40 attackers, that's going to be a crucial hit for fighting on the, on the inbound. You don't take the effort, you don't want that. Stahl will clear the puck out. Vancouver's got it on end and now finding Orone. Orone right toward the right wing. On the top racing into Hoffender. But stop here by Kochikov. And he will take a squeeze out of it to cover it up. Just about 5.24 to go. Now they're ready to do it again. 
The Nets wins the face off. That's blocked. Tara Vining will try to kick, carry that out. And Patterson will have it again to Hughes. He gets it over now to Suter. Skaney with the puck in now to take come it out. Here's Quinn Hughes. He will try to make his way in with a new set of chain. Suter with a two-on-two -two attack. Back to Suter. Going for a take. Another stop by the goaltender. Suter behind the net. Patterson. Look his way. Scores! It's a power play goal. Throw it to the nuts. Patterson with the goal. Big chain up for happening already. That's what Patterson has been doing. Strike that in. Get that goal. You know what I was always impressed? That was kind of not like this made that one passing the goal team. And this is what made that one clear and easy enough to have a pop on the street. They could not get back down by one. And that's not a bottom with the assist. These are take right now. This is what you really got to do. If you want to try to play your order with the NBA offense, make it compatible there. Because they really need to keep that one here going. And they have gotten a lot of it out of the way. Make that one clear, make it possible, make it stop, and do the best as they can. They really are stepping it in there for now. Now they're ready to do the next face-off. They're going down by one is a 4-3 game. With a win, with a tie shot, that's stopped by the goaltender. Yeah, that reaction put it up here for Kochikov. He's not going to really just try to like keep it out of him. He really wants to show up. If he doesn't get there with the puck in time, that's going to be a problem with that. Besser finds the pass to Mikheyev. Vancouver back into Kanza. Burns with the puck steal. Shot! Stop on the pad by Demko. Across the line and scrimmage. Scoop up along the board by Ava. Sajikov, chance shot, and redirected off the skater. In corner now, Slavin went down. Here's Shuri, up by Popolski. On a racing speed inbound, right toward the middle. Locked up. Shot stopped again by the goaltender. Rebounded by Garland. Ball shot. I no deflection given in. Slavin with the puck under three minutes. Racing it down. Another stop. Great chance here for Demko. Here's another one. Demko stops that puck again. 2.44 left to go in the second period. Making its way down toward the alley to do the next thing. And the faceoff is ready to make its appearance. And the Canucks wins another faceoff. 20 to 18 over, over the Canadian to the America. Throughout the, of the Hurricanes, it's going to be another day. Well, that probably sees what's going. I think Skate, he's doing a lot of too much charging out there. He will add another power play on the effort. It is 0-1, and, and now this one takes a 1-1. One one. Let's see if they tie this up. And the Canucks wins the faceoff. For a rebound chance, this one will keep it out for Pesky. And Pedersen's got a puck. With a power play goal, trying to find Hoglander. Hoglander right toward right wing. Dips it off. That's her shot. Misses. Lano with that second try. That's that by Kochikov. Coming down to a two-minute mark in the second period. Four threes to score. Looking for a tie game in the second. Now the win for the Canucks. A run of shot for a chance at first. This one's gone. Oh, blocker stop made by Kochikov. For another take to the run. Save! And Burns will take it out! Now oh, that was a wild one. How much did he do? That's like the biggest question. I was seeing for Kochikov, how has he been training like that? He said he's he never trained it before. I never know what's going on after Frederick Anderson must have not taken it in. That might be a hard
hard thing. Coming down to the end of the second period, they're looking like they wanted to tie this game up. Stahl wins the faceoff. And Feshke will give that puck out. Heronic not find Garland. Garland with the move, Gochikov save. Chance of the upper blocker. Nice stop here by the goaltender. Hurricanes battle that puck out. Final minute remaining in the second period. Dumps it out. And here's Mikheyev now finding Garonic. Deep the pass over to Miller. And Miller finding Garland. Garland chance in play. This one is knocked out, but a chance play. This one is knocked out. And Orlov will clear it out. Not the better way when you do four, but this is a lot of a hard racing inbound. And the power play's over. Unable to get the power play goal. One for two. And stopped by Kochikov. You know, never easy enough for that player because of Kochikov, he was really like saving it quickly. He's got to keep on moving when he does. If he doesn't get there in time, they're going to get that one like, achievable to have that tied up. Drury wins the face off as this game with the puck. Sprinting his way down, and Freeman will have it the air way. Pass over to Besser. Time ticking down, finding Mikheyev. Suits blocked up, and it's Drury on the other hand. And stopped by Demko. That is the second period. 4-3 score. Looks like there's a big takedown in that, as we will head to the third period soon to come back after this. Don't go anywhere, we've got the final period with you after this. You're watching a Stanley Cup final on EA Sports. Two down, one to go. Ready to start the third. And this has been a wildest game here in between the Carolina against the Vancouver. Let's see what finds out if there's a chance for the takeover for the win. I have a little bit of takes in between for you guys, so let's have your take. Well, there may be one way to happen. You need to take a slap and noticing that Jordan Stahl had made that one with a clearer look at the angle. He made that open look, but that pass angle wasn't really easy enough to have it settle down. Sometimes you got a little bit too much there because uh, everyone's in traffic jamming, but you don't have anyone else to open it up. So he's got to find another way to make a step into. Well, there's going to be another way to get this one in there. Let's find out if there's room. I'm pretty sure there is, huh? So it's going to be a lot of tech in there if there is. On a shot, stop made by Kuchinov. So that's about trying to let that puck out. And now he has it. Right toward the wing, lose the effort. And Suter will have it the airway. Right toward the inbound, looks the over. And burns with the puck steal. Here's Petrikov, he will have it over. Up and away, right around the net. Here's Kuz, he will now have a chance over to Poglander. Poglander trying to grab it in. Good catch released by Kochikov. You know how it happened now? Kochikov was really like getting this one catched up. And all that happens, caught that great save, got to get going. Teams are ready to make their preparement for a next faceoff. And Carolina wins the faceoff. Here's another one to Nages. Make the shorter right wing with a shot stopped by Demko. Got a little bit of an easier time on attack, but he definitely did well as he could. Made a stop, ready for the next faceoff. Now they're ready to do it again. Faceoff win for Miller. The rebound puts in for Natchez. Saved by the play. What an excellent take. In the corner, finding Miller. Oh, he almost made that one in. And this one puck sails out of the zone. You weren't expecting that had this happen. That one missed the tipped it over, and this one must have made that one with the pat safe. That blocker must have got that one coming in there. And he made that great deflection. Got it coming down. Got to make it quicker than that. But he made that one a great save. Miller's team ready for the next faceoff. Puck drop. And now they win. Oh, he went down already. Vancouver with the rebound. 
Drury has it over to Najes. And it is Burns, right toward the right wing. Toward the slot, Freeman with the puck steal. Now it goes off to JT Miller, to Mikheyev. Mikheyev for a tying chance. Suits missed wide. And it's roll right near the blue line. Here's Mikheyev to Freeman. Freeman for a chance to tie it. What a chance. Great stop by Kurchikov. And it's right toward behind the net. Ooh, that was a little bit of a wild play in the segment between them. May not be what they're expecting it for, but that's what that happens. You got to get through it. Here's Natchez, and this one rolls it into the corner. Bumps up. Now Natchez will have a chance. And the Abo blocked the shot. Natchez with a chance back at Bunny. Bunny shoots. That blocks. Great chance ever. Now Cole will have it over to fire it out. Carolina back the air away. Vancouver's got the puck. Zadorov right toward the corner. Center in the feed. And a big stop on the chain. Puts in. Now out is Skate. It's Garland. Now right over toward the corner. Here's Garcolton. Now finds a game of Juice in. Spins across back to Garland. Able to try to find another attacker. Toward the corner, finding the goal. For a tight chance? No, he missed that time opportunity. That's redirected off the skater. I don't know what's going to keep on happening out there. It looks like there's a lot of block shots. There's going to be a lot of changing. Be careful out there. The door off with the buck now again to Publander. Into a corner, in middle, that's redirected. Tito Terabinen, now will have it again on the other way. Basky, right toward the corner. Pass off to Stahi, block the shot. Big slap on the chain by Divka. Wilson, get back to Suter. Right toward the middle. For a chance in play. And both it out of here. Great defensive for the Hurricanes. Fast will have it in. That one stays out. And Hoaglander will have it in. Back to the Kane zone. Great stop by Kochikov. And he will stop that with a 14-40 to go. Now they're up and ready. Carolina has been pushing himself so far. They're still up ahead by one. And now the face-off win for Carolina. Orlov with a chance now back to Fast. Fast shot. Blocker stop made by Demko. Orlov. Chance in front. He scores! Nice cut inbound. That's his first goal in the finals. Not to be clear, not for Orlov. Been down with a great entry. Got it going. Now this is what happened. When Orlov was making it in the corner, he was racing in. Trying to let go away right for the attackers. He has no idea what he's going to do. So he made that one with the slicker move, and he just had that one slicking in the inbounds. It's now or nothing. 5-3 to score for Carolina. And the win will play it up for Carolina. Here's Martin up right toward the corner and the right. Off the stall on the shot. Off the blocker again by Demko. Martin up over the stall. Misses. And it sails all the way back to the Carolina zone. Clearing the puck out of it. Trying to get a puck away. Chaffield now will have that in the corner. On to a chance effort into the, in the attacking zone. Fires it. He broke the stick up. Gonna have to replace that one with a new one. There's a lot of broken sticks out there. Have to be careful if you're gonna trip over something. What a stop by Demko. Patterson trying to get back to Hughes. And Oblinger will try to clear it out. Toward the middle. Off and redirected. Here's an arrow one to Hughes. Chance in front. Wakes up. He's gone. Oh, JT Miller must have had that one with the 
Hayes. Oh, the funny thing about this, not going to be it. He's not done yet. He never really expected it to get to JT Miller. This one was really reaching it out. He finally had the middle, he made that one pass and hold it in motion. This is what happens now. When that cuts and put it in your motion, you have that one dripping out. Ben Kruber, trying to fight back in there. Five four game, nearing the back half of the period. And Miller will win the face off. First goal in the finals, and now Svechikov will have it the other way. Off to Terabini. Looks it over right toward the corner. Toward the middle, misses off the shot. And it skews with the rebound again to Miller. Miller, chance now in for a two-on-one opportunity. And another stop made by Kochikov. Here's Hughes, another big stop here. Orlov now sends it off to Ako, again to Natchez. The Canes are in the attack zone. Big hit on the play, and Besser will have it out. And they got offside. After the offside whistled on Carolina, 11.27 to go. Looks like the Canes want some revenge out there to try to even up. But there need to be a done problem out there before the time runs out. And McKay will have it again to Besser. Besser see pass again to Cole. Cole right toward the corner. And cut and bound. Up the stick it goes. And it's rebounded again by Slavin. Give again to Drury. Big smash kick. And Peters, better say, Bakoski and team trying to let them go right into work. Here's Freeman with a shot. And the pass save. Back to Slavin. And Ali Drury coming down right toward the Canucks up. Changing in pace. Looks again to Fax. Fax, man, it's broken up. Freeman with the puck seal. Puck grab by Michael Koski. Go over the Garland shot. That's missed again. Freeman trying to go in the middle. Go for the flat chain. It's been denied. That's on Coach Akab and another save. We pass the midway mark in the period. All set, ready to go. They are still looking to tie this game. A little bit of a close effort here. And it's Kern Case wins the face off. Burns down by Martina. This is the buck. And Martina. Here's Patterson. Patterson shoots. Not able to take it in here as this one goes wide. Freeman. Over to look. And a big stop chain. Slave it with a puck steal. Toward the corner. Find fast. Save. That's on Demko, and with only 9.13 to go in the third period. This is the game set, ready for the faceoff. 5-4, looking for a chance to take the even. And here's Slavin. Big stop by Demko. Moronic trying to let it keep it out. Marna, a chance to play. This one stays down. Over with the shot. He got it. He scores again! That's two goals for Jordan Stahl. Well, that might have been happened now. That's Jordan Stahl making a cut and switch. Made that one a great look. You know, the effort doesn't really pay that one a lot. All that special take in there for Jordan Stahl, that captain was making a wrist in there, and that one makes it a quick release bit. Just had that one pulled in, had that one taken down. Jordan Stahl adds another playoff to the postseason of the finals. Now they have that back up by six. To, to four and up by two. After a win, here's Miller. Trying to go for two. Doesn't able to hit that one as he misses. Miller, back to Besser. Besser taking a chance, up and above, and this one stepped out by Svet Kochikov. He skews right over again to Moronic. And a release back to Hughes. Beep to Dustin Miller. 
A back pass to Nikita for a chance play. Off the screen of the goaltender and slave it back to Ajo. Ajo right toward the corner. And it's Mikhail with the buck seal. Over to Moronik. And off again to Betzer. Trying to get that buck seal out. Back in the cutout zone. And it's Moronik trying to go for it again. Quinn uses Sky at this time. Watching him mount is Miller. Miller, right toward left. And bearing for the buck seal. There's a lot of bad takedowns out there. Herbeats are trying to make that one defensive clear. Block the shot, and now it's Cole with the chance. Over to Mikhail. Can't hold on to the puck as it goes right back to Kings to the Canuck zone. And finally give off to Natchez. Natchez for another take, and it's stopped again by the Demko. Pop pulls in right over into the center ice. And Cole will have it. Here's Puck goes in. In toward the middle. Had that one to take the goal, but that denies it again for the goaltender. Well, that is a little bit, well, not quite, but that was a little bit too close to call for it. That mean they could have been go down by one. There might be another way to have it all. Stay with the buck right over in toward the middle. He slapped to Pesky. Walker stopped by Demko. There was a bit of an absolute depth disappointment out there. That must have been what they were going with. Because they never just realize what they are expecting to do. This really needs to be on a tight race. You know, what they don't really do is they have a little time on attack. They have to play like they are right there on offense or defense. They're all over everywhere right now. But they need to be out there a lot of the time on the table. Here comes the attacking Grenadius. Looks in bound for backhander, and a bad stop made here come by Demko. Off to Natchez, save! How did he hold on to that? That was a little bit wild, just too close out there. But if he almost would have missed it, that's going to change it over. Now the wing for Bats, and it's off, and there's the penalty on the Canucks. That's going to be a tripping on Vancouver. It's all the nerves in the penalty box. And unexpected changes as how it's happened. This is what happens because if Hulkham to make this one a trip, he fell somebody over. This is not to be what they're referring to be. But playing in there, that's bad idea. Who had the better call? I sent it over to Life Ring. I'm going to say that the better option in this one here had to be turning for Elias Pedersen. Really been showing it how he does it with a snipe. And a better way to have the puck on stream advantage for a power play goal. So if their number take is, in game three and four, it will be another way to have Pedersen take it all. It's Drury and a shot glove saved by Demko. Coming down to a five minute mark in the third period as we're wrap, wrap, almost wrapping it up here for the second game of the night. Sebastianago. A bad for liability may have an all to take in with his first eye is perceptible on his play. If better range is good up in a power play range, let's hope if it does more. Madison will try to fling it up. Here's Brett Burns, he will fight, take the puck out. And here's Chilson. Chilson trying to let that one go. And Buck sent back into the Canucks zone. Here's the door off. He will now have it over to again to Jolson. Jolson making his way across. For a chance in play. Big save by Kochikov. The Fern Kings are back in the offense zone looking for Bunny. Running shot. And that's off the skater of the door off. Dumps the puck into the Canuck zone, to the, to the Kane zone. Here's Burns for Zaco. Under 30 seconds for Carolina power play in the third period. Zaco looks to Svechikov. On a shot. Big glove stop here by Demko. 3.42 left to go in the third period as we're nearing down the end of the regulation period. Officials games are ready to drop the puck. Carolina up by two. And 
and the win will play it in for Vancouver. Oh, good news, ready to get out there, ready to go. Oh, a big hit! Must have had that one without a give for Cole. Oh, that's just unbelievable. How crucial is that supposed to be? That's like a curse thing to know for. Lost the effort as fast will have it. You know, playing it in for the offense is not really always to be easy enough. I say that, that the Carolina Hurricanes are trying to make another new way to get in through it. That was like a big on a hard takedown. It never really happened at all. That's what happens most of the time. They really are just kind of trying to like get them out of the way. And the faceoff way for Carolina. Here's Natchez, and this one carries out. Natchez trying to roll it in. One stop by Demko. We're nearing down the two minute mark in the third period. And there's not much time left here, and they need to get some away to get right through it. Face off win for the Canucks. Here's Hollander now over again to Suter. Suter right toward in the middle. Burns with a puck steal. And here's Shrewy now finds Slavin. Here's Budding. Right toward the right wing. Went with the kick. Rebounded off by Cole again to Volklander. Off to Suter. Suter right toward the wing. Nowhere to go, finding Cole. Cole inbound to Miller. Blocked it up by Bunny. Here we come, right toward the right wing. Over to Burns. The Bunny shot, and it's stopped by the goaltender. Officials are getting ready to drop the puck. Just coming down to a one minute mark that is already passing the two minute mark. Carolina up by two. Burns, toward the middle. Miller with the puck seal. Besser trying to get out quickly. And that one turns it out. Burns takes it back again to Spetsikov. And Teravainen will have that one out. Cole trying to kick it. Scoop up along the board by Miller. Here's Besser. Misses a chance. I'll go with the other way. Swipes it out. And Cole will have an extra skater to get into it. Look toward middle. Besser. What a save. Unbelievable by Kochikov. He is really having the biggest saving of the night. All that big effort? I mean, I don't know what he's going to do. This one is really like taking a hard chance effort. Ago wins the face off. Slavin will now find again the Terravine. And it looks like Terravine will get it. Missed the target wide, and we're under a minute left. Madison will now give off to Suter. Suter chance to Miller. Shoots! Pat save! Here's Slavin trying to kick that one out of here. And it's over now to Burns. 35 seconds left remaining in the regulation. Spetsikov now over to Slavin. Trying to move around again to Terramine in the open room. And it's taken away by Pedersen. Here's Miller. Chance in front. Save again by Kuchikov. 15 seconds left to go. Spetsikov locks a shot by Freeman. Freeman got to get moving. Oh, and they're not playing Miller. Shoots. Redirecting. Unbelievable. That stops. And that should do it for now. Carolina stops down the Canucks. 6 4 final score. There had to be no way to that because the Coach of Cup made this with an excellent ability to do it all. That's what their team does make it accountable to get back home to do it again. Now, that's what crazy is. There's nothing to say anything what they have done for. That's it for now. I hope you all enjoy the game. Terry Cruz along with Test 2 and Ball Play Bad and Life Ring. This has been a presentation of the finals of the Stanley Cup. Thanks for joining us. Good night. All right, thank you so much. Time for three star players of the game. Third star goes to Jordan Martin with the goal, two assists, and three gets. 
half that one coming in with the great assist. And the second star goes to Jordan Stahl. Two goals, one assist, and three kicks. Made this one a little bit of a change offer to get that one passed by. And your first star player of the game. All go to Frederick Kochikov with 90 saves of the game. He just made that one nice. How ability that is. That's what's how it's going to be. And taking it over and a, a big look at the chain and the total statistics on the other side of it. 94 over 69 for the total shots on goal for Vancouver. They also got 73 over 55 for Vancouver on the hits. And it was 659 over 605 for Vancouver time on attack. And it was 91 percentage over here, over 90 percentage for Carolina passing. 33 face-off wins, that was currently very kind of like a hard way to make that one through. Easier way to get through from in between the back-to-back face-off wins in between. 33 or 30 face-off wins for Carolina. And a penalty kill was on four minutes for Carolina and two-minute penalty kill for Vancouver. Only one power play goal for Vancouver with one out of two with 331 in the power play minutes. Well, I guess that's it for now. If you are waiting on to get your next game up, we've got the Heat at home playing at the Casilla Center, play against the Dallas Mavericks. I hope you enjoyed this one here, and we'll see you all again pretty soon on the other side for game number three. This is Lightfall and Boomer. Thanks for joining with us, and we'll see you again for a while as the Stanley Cup Final on EA Sports style. Have a great night in Vancouver. So long, everybody. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.